This is going to be a really quick video and it's how to change the color of your hamburger menu icon. Sometimes you may just want to set this in the standard site styles area or for some reason you may want to change it on one page in particular. And so this video is just going to show you both options step by step. So option one, we're going to click up here in site styles and then we're going to go into colors and then we need to go into mobile view so we can actually see our hamburger menu. Then we want to go into whatever color palette that the header is using. So we're going to here and this is on this page in particular. And then if we hover over the nav and click on it, you're going to see navigation links here. So we go in and then we can change the navigation links color like this. And that's going to affect basically anything in the nav. Nice and simple. So we saved that. And this will change the color for that palette only. So for instance, on the classes page, we've got this light color palette. So we do the same. We'd go into site styles, color, then we'd see, okay, this is lightest too. Click on the nav, navigation links. And again, we can change that. So we can set it for um, basically every different palette that we use. But let's say you have another page that uses lightest too but you want to change the color on only one of those pages. So we'll just keep it on classes. What we do is we go into website and then we're going to go into website tools and then custom CSS. Then we're going to pop our code in here. So burger inner div background color. And you can see that's immediately changed in. So you can put a hex code in. You can just write, <laughs> write the color. You can put RGB, what you know, whatever you want in there. So you can play around with that. But to get this onto just one page, now we've checked that it works. We'll get rid of this. And we're going to go into the back end of the page. So we click the cog, click advanced, and then we're going to paste this in. And then either side, we're going to put some style tags like so. Hit save. And you can see that it's turned to blue. Now, this is something that's only available on a professional plan or higher. So if you're on a personal plan, so like the, the lowest hosting plan, then you won't be able to use this feature. So what we do in that case is we get rid of this and then we go back into CSS. So website tools, custom CSS, and then we'll paste that back in, get rid of the style tags. And then what we need to do is wrap this code in the collection ID. So to do that, we need to use the Squarespace block identifier plugin, which is a free Chrome plugin. I'll link it in the description. And basically we want to get the collection ID. So I've already got it installed here. If I just click on this, it's going to give me the collection ID, the section ID, block ID, etc. I'm just going to click on the collection and that's going to copy it to my clipboard. Then I'm going to paste that in like so. Hit save. And there we go sorted and so those are the ways that you can change your hamburger color on squarespace if you found this useful please make sure to leave a like and hit subscribe and if you want me to build your squarespace website you can get in touch using the links in the description